Hello Gemini, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your money and career tarot reading for the sign of Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus and it will be from February to March 2021. So let's get straight into your reading Gemini and pull your first oracle card. So what do we have for our lovely Geminis? Thank you Angel Spirits Guides. Message for Gemini. This will be for February to March 2021 in terms of money and career only. Thank you. What do we have for Gemini? Thank you. Oh, interesting. I think I had this for Libra, but you know, we have Black Cat. Your luck will soon change. Now, interesting when I see this card. There may well be some kind of sign that you're sent, Gemini. You might see a black cat, which may well be around the point where your look will change. You know, I'm just saying that because I sometimes feel it with this card. Um, but nevertheless, it's a good sign, the card, that your look is going to change. Okay. So what do we have for Gemini, please? Angel Spirits Guides. Message for Gemini. Message for our lovely Geminis. Thank you. So we have visualize abundance in all forms. God gave you, and it's whatever God means to you, Gemini, God gave you such great spiritual power that everything you visualize eventually becomes reality. Hold a steady vision of that which is beautiful, healthful, positive, and filled with blessings, and that is what you will experience. Isn't that beautiful? Okay, so I'm going to pull your overarching energy for February to March in Money in Korea. What's the overarching energy, please, Angel Spirits Guides, for our lovely Geminis? February to March in Money in Korea. Only thank you. Okay. <laughs> Card of Leo, Strength. Very nice energy indeed. A reminder that you are strong enough. You have the power. Very nice energy. Okay, so I'm going to pull five cards. So the first card is the current challenge or issue you face in money and career. Second card is what's going for you, Gemini. Third card is essentially what's going against you. So any issues or obstacles in your way. Third card, sorry, fourth card is advice from spirit, and the fifth card is the future outcome. So, what do we have for Gemini, please? Angel spirits guides in money and career only, please. February to March 2021. Thank you for Gemini. Message for Gemini. Thank you. So I have the five of coins, that's your challenge. The page of swords is what's going for you, what's against you. We have the seven of pentacles. The two of cups is advice from spirit and the outcome we have the knight of swords gemini this is you as well bottom of the deck we have the eight of wands it's pretty much confirming your card this eight of wands i think so lovely energy indeed so your luck is going to change visualize abundance in all forms focus positive energy you know that kind of energy and you will understand how to master your situation and bring change the strength card is a card of Leo, the need to be in your power, connect to your inner power, your inner strength, your inner courage. Yeah. To overcome fear or adversity or obstacle in your external environment. So this is a beautiful thing. The interesting thing that I'm getting with this as well, Gemini, because you are all about communication utilizing your words in a way that can persuade and shape your reality you know and further and advance yourself you know it's that kind of energy you are very good you're the, you're the communicator of, of the zodiac 
so there's definitely this energy here that I'm getting on being very influential and persuasive yeah very persuasive in the next month or two know your power that is your strength yeah that I'm definitely picking that up quite strongly play to your strengths as well play to your strengths it will set you in good stead so if there is something that you need to talk a conversation or communication I mean that could be interviews that could be sales pitches um you know pitching an idea to you know banks I mean call it what you will it, it feels in this situation you have the ability to be incredibly powerfully persuasive yeah and shape and bend people to your will through the power of communication so there's definitely this energy that I'm getting of just make sure you you know you as long as you do the work as long as you know the fact you know the facts and what you're talking about it, I'm definitely getting this energy Gemini of you have this great persuasiveness around you you are of influence in the next month or two know your influence and know that strength of yours and play to it I'm definitely getting that message so we have the five of coins here I like it in the challenge position you know the five of coins it is a disruptive card the fives it can be about outcast rejected job losses changes in your financial circumstances could well be to do with the pandemic here might not be um but it's feeling the pinch sometimes you know in this when this card appears you need to ask for help in terms of money from from other people you know or banks you know or loans that kind of energy so it can be about asking for help you know um can also be a card of begrudging other people this as well and the message with the fives it can be very very consuming if you allow it to be you can feel the lack with the five of coins the lack can really own you and then that kind of puts a block on you visualize a, visualizing abundance so the message here is don't let the lack own you the stained glass window of the church is just reminding you whatever your spiritual path you are being watched over by God the divine the universe even in your darkest times even when you're feeling lack and there is a need to get perspective to, to take a step back and see the big picture now I said I like it in the challenge position because it, for me in the challenge position the five of pentacles can be the potential recovery from this situation so the potential for having recovery for experiencing some recovery some shift yeah now what's going for you we have the page of swords is, is in essence in essence a message of truth so maybe some truth communication uh, discovering something hearing something that is bringing the beginnings of change the beginnings of something new you know this is the wind of change card for me as a reader so f there's definitely this energy of your luck is soon changing it might well be in this situation you're hearing something or there may well be some communication or learning something or some information coming to light maybe to do with business career money areas opportunity for example and it's the first signs of, of getting that through the seven of of pentacles or coins gemini what's going against you yeah this is the this is the frustration card this is i'm trying to advance myself i'm working so hard to pr to provide gain and to set myself up for long-term sustainable you know financial security yeah but I'm, I'm just not there yet you know regardless of how much effort and work I'm putting into something I'm not there yet I'm not quite seeing the results of my efforts and the message here is good things come to those that pay the, to those that wait be patient keep going keep persevering keep pushing through because you will get the reward that you're you're looking for here and um, so there's definitely an energy of perseverance with that what's going against you just keep on at it and that might be where you're feeling the lack here where you're thinking oh they're fine and i'm not um 
will my circumstances ever change and then the lack can just suddenly take over if you're not careful so you might be experiencing that a little bit advice from spirit i love this energy because i'm definitely getting the energy of you bonding with somebody <clears throat> yes this can be to do with partnerships collaborations so for some of you there could be some kind of business partnership investment opportunity um setting something up with somebody or it could well be bonding with somebody in terms of potential jobs you know this can be an offer or an invitation finding a kindred spirit you know that kind of energy like-minded you know people you know so it definitely feels in this situation that there is somebody that you're bonding with somebody of influence somebody who might be bringing in an offer an invitation for you and it's something that lifts your heart you know um this can be uh, expressing change expressing views to each other um and it's it's like-minded expressions you know it's that kind of energy similar views things that are close to your heart you have similar things in common same goals so it definitely feels either there's somebody that you're bonding with this can also be offers or invitations coming your way something that is going to bring you joy <coughs> sorry gemini my voice is going it's funny that i'm talking about communication with you and my voice is going um but yeah some kind of offer or an invitation there and then gemini we have this this is your card this is you so you back in your element but what was you were learning of and then there was some kind of frustration energy here not moving quickly enough i'm definitely getting this is the shift um and i have it doubly confirmed by the eight of wands which is also a big shift for the better so both of these cards mean conversations communication that bring change yeah and you know this can be about positive conversations communications that bring change um, and, and i feel it's to do with this the two of cups offers invitations bonding with somebody it feels very beautiful here and remember remember the two is the beginnings of something new so again this energy here gemini the communication energies the conversational energies mercury and sagittarius so the new journey begins through communication through your persuasiveness through your ability to persuade and communicate and sell yourself you know it feels that kind of energy like-minded souls kindred spirits so again this is definitely this energy of persuasiveness this in the next month or two for you is responsible for your look changing and i like the jupiterian association with this as well to do with luck um the eight of wands out of the blue there is shift there is opportunity there is positive conversation that brings the shift um sometimes this can be distance energy or travel so it might resonate for some of you um online even as well communication technology so online interviews or online connections for example but definitely definitely bringing some powerful shift your way so news that brings some shift in your circumstances potentially offers invitations a bond formed here or partnerships too so lovely lovely energy um just remember this because i was feeling this card very strongly your power to communicate and persuade okay final message for gemini please in terms of money and career thank you i've got three cards it's interesting i've got the cat again my goodness and it's interesting i've got speak your truth with this one again this communication so have strength faith and conviction in your voice it has never been more needed how strange that that's come out the cards are so in sync gemini they're very much saying the similar thing play to the specific strength that you have which is your ability to communicate sell we have um raven wise woman a change is coming yeah i mean that's very clear 
we know the shift is coming here very beautiful indeed towards you know the end of this reading and we have llama soul growth growth is never easy have faith and trust in the journey <laughs> We spoke about journey before, didn't I, with this? And I definitely see some kind of new journey unfolding for you. It feels very beautiful, Gemini, but the communication aspect, the power to persuade is so strong in the next couple of months. So I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful month for you all, month or two for you all even, and I will see you next time. Thank you.